Well, let's go back to the newsroom where we have Eva Anderson to talk a little bit more about what we heard about education tonight, Eva. Well, we heard a lot about education. Governor Reynolds saying she'd like to see a bill that gives all families the option to send their children to school in person during the pandemic. And right now we're seeing responses pour in from you, the viewers. I posted on my Facebook page, Eva Anderson TV, and I've got some of your reactions tonight. I want to read a few of them uh, specifically. Um, during the beginning of the speech, Governor Reynolds said, quote, despite what we've been through or maybe because of it, the condition of our state has never been stronger. So I said, what do you think? We're tracking your responses tonight. Molly Jennings said, quote, she has taken every opportunity to avoid leading us safely through this pandemic and our state is suffering. Dwayne Nofke said simply, no, no, this is not the best condition our state has ever been in. Tom Carmen from Urbana, Iowa says, our state is doing very well. We're all very lucky to be able to have our state open and to be able to live our lives the best we can with the situation we are in. Thank you, Kim, for doing your best and evolving with the pandemic that nobody knows what the next day will bring. So again, um, some differing reaction there, some still showing some frustration, others in full support of Governor Reynolds. and. It, Particularly regarding education, I asked you what you thought about the governor asking the legislature to put forth a bill that provides every family with an option to send their child to school in person if that is their wish. Kayla Johnson wrote, by God's grace, my son has been in person all year but not in public school. So Kayla expressing there that she's very thankful that her son has been able to attend school in person. And we know um, that there are families for whom child care is not an option financially. And that was one of the things that Governor Reynolds said tonight. She wanted to make sure she supports those families. She also supports the option of open enrollment for families. So wants to make sure that no matter where they live, they have the ability to send their child to a district that they feel um, can suit them and best educate them. Stephanie. Right. Eva, thank you so much. We appreciate your time.